Welcome to Silicon Hub series on semiconductor evolution. Please visit us at www.siliconhub.ai for more information. For decades, we've made chips smaller, faster, and cheaper. But what happens when physics says, stop? We've talked about Moore's law, the idea that the number of transistors on a chip doubles roughly every two years. For decades, that prediction held true. But as we push into the single-digit nanometer era, Moore's law is running into serious roadblocks. Why? Well, we're now dealing with features just a few atoms wide. At this scale, quantum effects start to interfere. Electrons can leak through insulating layers. Heat becomes harder to manage. Variability increases. To keep up the pace, chipmakers have turned to new tricks. FinFET's 3D transistor structures that offer better control. EUV lithography, using extreme ultraviolet light to etch finer patterns. Multi-chip packaging, combining multiple dyes into a single product. And chiplets, like Lego for semiconductors. Moore's law might be slowing, but innovation isn't. We're seeing a shift from more transistors to better transistors, smarter layouts, and specialized processors. And on the horizon, quantum computing, neuromorphic chips, and carbon nanotubes could be the next leap forward. The era of brute force scaling is ending, but a new era of creative semiconductor design is just beginning.